It is now January, and time begins to turn the wheel of his revolution. The woods begin to lose the beauty of their spreading boughs, and the proud oak must stoop to the axe. The squirrel now surveyeth the nut and the maple, and the hedgehog rolls up himself like a football. An apple and a nutmeg make a gossip's cup, and the ale and the faggot are the victuallers' merchandise. The northern black dust is the during fuel, and the fruit of the grape heats the stomach of the aged. Down beds and quilted caps are now in the pride of their service, and the cook and the pantler are men of no mean office. The ox and the fat weather now furnish the market, and the coney is so ferreted that she cannot keep in her burrow. The courier and the lime-rod are the death of the fowl, and the falcon's bells ring the death of the mallard. The totting gelding makes a way through the mire, and the hare and the hound put the huntsman to his horn. The barren doe subscribes to the dish, and the smallest seed makes sauce to the greatest flesh. The dried grass is the horse's ordinary, and the meal of the beans make him go through with his travail. Fishermen now have a cold trade, and travellers a foul journey. The cook-room now is not the worst place in the ship, and the shepherd hath a bleak seat on the mountain. The blackbird leaveth not a berry on the thorn, and the garden earth is turned up for her roots. The water floods run over the proud banks, and the gaping dister leaves his shell in the streets, while the proud peacock leaps into the pie. Muscovia commodities are now much in request, and the water spaniel is a necessary servant. The load horse to the mill hath his full back burthen, and the thresher in the barn tries the strength of his flail. The woodcock and the pheasant pay their lives for their feed, and the hare, after a course, makes his hearse in a pie. The shoulder of a hog is a shoeing horn to a good drink, and a cold arms make a beggar shrug. To conclude, I hold it a time of little comfort, the rich man's charge, and the poor man's misery. Farewell.